Hello everyone. Now this video will teach you how to read the ROM from uh, Toshiba hard drives at a higher speed. As all we know that for Toshiba hard drives, we can only read the ROM from the hard drives by the program. We cannot write. Now let's try to check for this one. And this is one new model for the Toshiba hard drives. And here we can set the baud rate to read the ROM. We can open the COM port and test the baud rate. Now we test again and see. We can try to change to this one. Okay, so this is the highest baud rate for the Toshiba hard drives. And then we can try to read with read the ROM here. Read ROM, only read ROM, no read ROM. Now we can click OK. Now we can see the program starts to back up the ROM at the Baud rate of two three zero four hundred. If users use the default baud rate, then the ROM rate is very slow. If users want to write the ROM, users can only use the programmer, the flash programmer, to write the ROM. It's the best, users have this one. The HDD ROM chip pin reader set, and users can read the ROM from the ROM chip directly with this pin reader. So this one is very helpful and help users to protect the original ROM chip because users don't need to sort a ROM chip off. Now we can see this is a DFL Toshiba Fujitsu from a repair program. And we enter the Toshiba from a repair program. And then here from our operations, read ROM in by command. And here we set the highest baud rate to read the ROM by COM. Knock window. And this is the processing bar to read the ROM. So we can use the DFL program to read the ROM and use the pin reader to write the ROM. Of course, if users remove the PCB, the Toshiba PCB, users can read and write the ROM by the pin reader within just several seconds. This is the best way to read and write the ROM for Toshiba hard drives. Mostly, to read and write the ROM, with the pin reader, this function or this tool is used or required when the Toshiba hard drives have some kind of DVR lock and users cannot operate with the firmware modules, cannot read and write the modules, cannot read and write the ROM with the program so at this time, we need the HDD ROM chip pin reader to read and write the ROM to remove the DVR lock and then access to the data. Or sometimes, users just want to remove the DVR lock and then use the drives again and to use to read and write the ROM 
is also required. So this is how we use the DFL tools to read or read and write the ROM for Toshiba hardware.